This is a quick walkthrough on how to use Reason in Rewire mode with Pro Tools, and then also how to synchronize a video utilizing Pro Tools if you're working on a Reason project because you can't do that within the Reason application alone. So this is a nice little workaround. So first and foremost, if you have a Pro Tools version older than 11, like Pro Tools 10, uh, find the Reason application in your Applications folder and go to the actual Reason app and then right click and go to Get Info or hit Command I and pull up this window and then make sure to check Open in 32-bit mode like I have checked here. So we're going to force it to open in 32-bit instead of 64-bit mode and that's because Pro Tools 10 uh, also runs in 32-bit mode and for them to be compatible you have to have them both be the same. So that's, that's one pro problem that I've noticed a lot of people have ran into. So once you get Pro Tools opened up, you can just start a blank project. And we're mainly just going to be using this Pro Tools project to allow synchronization with Reason. So I've actually set this up already. Um, so I'm going to open this rewire file. And what it's actually going to do is automatically go ahead and open Reason right away when I open the program. And the reason that this happens is because first I found a video file and I dragged it into my tracks and put the video file right here on its own video track. And then you go to your mix window and hit Command Shift N to create a new track or go up to tracks here in the menu. And you want to create one new instrument track and hit create, but since I already created it, I'll hit cancel. And then on your top insert, like you see here, go to your plugins and go to instrument and you should see your reason in your instruments and it'll pop up this little rewire window and then that's when your reason application will automatically uh, go ahead and open up. So I'm gonna go now to window and in fact, what I'll do first is just minimize these and I'll go to Window and click on Video to bring up the video. And you might have to do a little rearranging to be able to see everything, but if all goes according to plan, I start Reason playing, and then if I Command Tab to my Pro Tools app, there we go, the video is playing along with Reason. So it's not the perfect solution, but it's at least a way that you can synchronize if you're uh, working with clips that you want to see exactly where the instruments or beats fall with the video. So there you go.